Hey everyone, in this video I want to take a quick look at how some calculators display a scientific notation. For more information about scientific notation, you can check the resources in the description. This video is just going to cover how um, some calculators will display it. So let's say you're doing your calculations, something, 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 and you get something like this. You get a long string of numbers and then an, a capital E and some number after it. What the heck does that mean? This is actually a calculator's way of displaying scientific notation. Basically, the calculator is saying, dude, this number is really big, so I'm going to display it to you in, in sort of a shorthand form. Uh, this particular number here, 4.37, let's run into the nearest um, hundredth just to make it less writing for me. So we have 4.38 if I round that. So that's, that's the part rounded. The E actually means times 10, and the number after the E is the exponent that goes on the 10. So that's what this number means. If you had to calculate 15 to 15 power for some reason, the number is so, so quite large, um, the calculator has displayed it like this. So E means times 10, and the number after the E is the exponent. Sometimes that number might be a negative. That happens. That's fine. Um, but it's just the exponent on the 10. Some calculators don't do this. Some calculators will, like this little one here, um, they might be brave enough to give you the whole number. That's fine. You're going to see the first, the, the string of numbers is the same. So we got four, three, seven, eight, nine, three, blah, blah, blah. This one is just not in scientific notation. Um, and then some calculators, um, like... If you haven't already bookmarked desmos.com slash scientific, totally do it. This is a fabulous free online calculator. You can access it from your phone, from your tablet, from your computer, whatever. Uh, Desmos is not related to SSC, but we love them. Um, and this one actually has a neat feature where if you type in a question and it's going to be saying different notation, it actually does it for you. It, does, it shows you how, how it is. This one is not random like I, like I did, but you still see we have that times 10 to the 17. So however your calculator displays it, if you see that capital E right there or something similar, it just means times 10 to whatever power comes afterwards. Again, for more information about scientific notation, you can check the resources in the description and we will call this good. Best of luck.